Hey guys, how you going? It's uh, Troy here. Uh, something new from SG Custom Silver. Uh, a lot of you guys that are into your beads would be familiar with a lot of different Spartan helmet beads that are on the market. Um, Cell's done something uh, completely different. He's created like a demonic gladiator uh, helmet bead, which is really, really awesome. What you can see in front of you is a prototype and then a final design. Um, I'll give you a look at the prototype as well because it's got some features that I really like about it and it's also in a slightly different finish which um, the uh, the final design is available in two different finishes so you'll get a bit of a, an idea of what you're getting if you want to order one. Um, just an awesome, awesome bead guys. Uh, I think you're really, really going to like this bead if you're into gladiators and stuff and skulls. So, so yeah, first up, the bead itself, it's really quite a heavy bead. I'll annotate that in now. Um, you can see the face shield here, um, but what sets this bead apart from a lot of other beads on the market is the detail that's in it. Uh, you've got these uh, three skulls on the side, both sides. They look really, really awesome. This is uh, in the polished finish, and you can see the contrast between the, the polished areas and the shadowed areas, which looks really, really cool. Um, one of the other big features of this guy is the de demonic uh, little demon head sitting proud of the helmet on top on the helmet ridge. Uh, he just looks awesome. That's a really cool feature. Um, what I really like about this bead too is the way that the paracord comes up between the helmet ridge like that. That's something that you, you don't see a lot of. Um, it's really quite, uh, quite a unique uh, thing that Cell's done there. I don't think I've any seen anything like that. Again, you can see that beautiful polished silver surface, 925 silver. Um, another big feature of this bead and, and something that Cell likes to incorporate in his beads when he can is uh, this hollowed out area so that your uh, any knots that you use can come over and be concealed completely. Um, this will even hold just a normal uh, knot tied in paracord. As you can see, easily accommodates two pieces of full uh, full-size paracord as well. I'll just pull this away from the camera a bit so you get a bit of a, an idea of its uh, overall appearance. Again, you can't see that big cavity that can hide, uh, hide a big knot and yeah, gives you some options to do um, that you can use when you're doing your paracord work. On the inside, should have a maker's mark. It's a little bit hard to see because of the darkness. But yeah, just an awesome, awesome bead. Those, uh, those little skulls look awesome and that demon on the ridge is fantastic. The prototype, uh, this is in the satin finish. I really like this finish. Um, the bead itself is a lot smaller, the prototype. That's why Cell didn't go with it. But... I've got a real soft spot for this bead. I think it's really cool. And one of the things that I like about it especially is the ridge that's on the front of the of the face shield there. I think that little bit of extra detail just gives this um, something a little bit special. Uh, the demon itself is still really, really cool. I'll get this in focus for you guys. Yeah, the demon itself, he's really, really cool. And then those skulls again, which fill that, that area on the side of the helmet again just awesome. This has the cavity, uh, as you imagine it's not um, not as big as the other one but it still does work as a, uh, a not hiding cavity for sure. And yeah I really like the satin, I think it looks cool. Uh, the bead comes with a certificate of authenticity which you can see here. These are Cell's new certs which you would have seen in my other vid, uh, made out of really nice cardboard. They open up you see that big skull there straight off the bat and then tells you about your uh, your purchase and all signed by cell and yeah these are these are quite nice just a bit better than some business cards and some other things that I've seen used as certificates of authenticity I think that's a really nice touch so yeah guys that's the uh, the gladiator bead um, yeah, I'm glad to have this one in the collection. It's a really, really cool bead, and to um, to have a prototype as well as the final cut um, is something really uh, quite specky as well. So, all right, guys, I'll talk to you later. See ya.